Hi guys, Steve here. This is a quick video on how to use a taming calculator. I use this one as it's the most accurate. And you can find a link to it in the description box below. Click the show me more text if you can't see it. I'm doing this video so I can refer to and link to it. So I don't have to keep repeating myself on each individual dinosaur I tame. For this example, I'm going to select Mosasaurus. Will you select any dinosaur you need it for? First of all, select the creature we want to tame. So I'm going to click and scroll down to Mosasaurus. Next put in what level it is. 116. The taming method is standard. If you're on an official server, you leave the multipliers as they are. To the right of Kibble, it shows you the type needs to be Quetzal. And click it to see how many you need. With the current info, it tells you it needs 3 hours and 37 minutes to tame. It will give you an estimate of how many narcotics you'll need. For this one it's almost 1,500, but I'd take 2,000, just in case something goes wrong. Next, because we're starving our dino, click the starve text, and that'll open up another section. On the top two bars, you want to put your maximum and current food of your Giga's stats. The most maximum food is 20,000. And because it's gone hungry for a short while, its current food is 19,000. Once that's done, it tells you how long you have to starve it for. It's adjusted the time for 3 hours 19 minutes. At the bottom you can set a time for an alarm to ring. That lets you know how long is left before you give it kibble. I recommend adding a couple of kibble, just in case it's a few off. Plus I would give the dino the kibble a couple of minutes before you're supposed to. Then if there's any leftover kibble, you can take it out and save it. Then, when you've finally done all that, you've tamed yourself a new dino. You can find out how to tame a Mosa here. Or this link shows you how to tame a Giga. Thanks for watching. If it was helpful, please like and subscribe. Don't forget to check out the video links at the end, and hopefully I'll see you again. Goodbye.